In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the unboxing and a complete setup of HP NY6555E all-in-one printer. This is a wireless printer. It can do copy, print and scan. It also has an ADF tray on the top. Let's start the unboxing and then we will do the setup of this printer. So printer comes with the manual. Here we have the setup ink cartridges. Set of two ink cartridges HP68 and you can also wire the normal ink cartridge so that you can use them after using the initial power cable and a leaflet for ink cartridge. These days printer comes in a laminated sheet, so you just have to remove it. Remove the protective tape. Remove this. Lift it up, take this page out and you can also lift this up, lift the ink chamber and remove it. Now we can close it again. For the initial setup, first we have to plug in the power cable that goes at the back side of the printer that is here. power button is here so you can press it once so our printer is starting go to the printer display panel on the main screen you have to select your language confirm select the country of residence on the next screen it will say go to the setup website for the further setup but right now we are going to do the setup using the screen so first we will load the paper, open the paper tray, adjust the size, you can load A4 size or letter size paper, place it here, on the display panel it will ask you to confirm the paper, so press ok. Next step is to install the setup ink cartridges, for that we have to lift this printer from this side and the ink chamber will move and come to the position. To install the ink cartridges, remove the ink cartridge from the plastic packaging. Also remove this orange seal. Place black on this side, just place it here and push it in. It will lock itself. Same with the coloring cartridge. Remove the seal. Just place it here. Slide it under the lock and push it in. Push this door down and close it gently. Press OK. It will ask you to do the alignment. Click align. Paper output tray is here. Once your printer print the alignment page, we have to scan it. Open the lid. Place this page facing down on the scanner. And click on the scan icon on the display panel. Cartridge alignment is done on the main screen. Once the cartridge alignment is done, you will see on the main screen return to the setup website. But still we are going to complete the setup using this display panel. Click on the question mark. 
scroll down and click exit skip HP software click exit for updates scroll until the next button is active and click on the next select updates for your printer you can select auto updates click save select date and time and continue you will see thanks for choosing HP and it will display the main screen of the printer so our printer initial setup is done next step is to do the wireless setup of the printer so that we can use it for wireless printing and scanning right now we can only use it for the copy for the Wi-Fi setup click on the menu scroll down and click on the settings click network Select Wi-Fi, click on the Wi-Fi setup, start. Select your Wi-Fi network and click next. Select it and enter the Wi-Fi password. This is your home Wi-Fi password. Enter the complete password, press OK to apply the password, click on the submit and press OK again. Press OK, printer is connected to the Wi-Fi, click on the home button. Our printer is available on the Wi-Fi network. Next step is to add this printer in a device for wireless printing and scanning. You can use an iPhone, Android phone, laptop or Macbook. And you just have to download the HP Smart app. Open this app. In the app we will add the printer. So go to the setup or add printer. Select the second option already connected to network. It will display HP and YS6500 E series printer. Select it. We can see our printer is available. It says finish setup. So now we can go online and complete the rest of the things. So once you click on the finish setup, it will take you to the further. On the next screen, click on the accept all terms and conditions. On the display panel, it will ask you to click on the allow. If you have a HP Plus account, you can use that. If you don't want, you can just click on the do not activate HP Plus. You can decline this offer. Click on the continue. You can enroll for the ink delivery. If you don't want it, click on the do not enable ink delivery. Skip the offer. We have already installed the paper and the ink. So continue setup. Select auto updates for your printer and click on the save. Let's print the welcome page so we can print it. So, printer is working, it is connected. Click on the Send link if you want to send it to other devices or you can skip it. You will see your printer with estimated level of ink on the main app. And now we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning. For example, to do the scanning, we can use the scanner bed. Or we can use the ADF. So open the tray. Place the page you want to scan. 
so it should be facing up like this once you hear the sound that means it is installed properly on the app click on the scan button and it should start the scanning process automatically and you can scan multiple pages at once so that will save the time and you can save them as a jpeg file or pdf file in pdf it will be saved as a single pdf file in jpeg it will be different file for each page so scanning of the first page is done we are not going to add more right now so it will finish the scan scan is done it's just transferring it to see your scan click on this icon and that is our scan to save it click on the share or save button continue click on the save to hp smart app so that will be easy to locate this go to the home button for printing you can select any photo any document and you can start printing so this way we can do the complete setup of the printer so we installed the ink loaded the paper then we did the wi-fi setup and we installed the printer in our smartphone using our home or office wi-fi network thanks for watching